What's special about this game is that you really get to play the part of Indiana Jones. You know, when you think of Indiana Jones, you think adventure. You, one minute can be exploring a temple, you know, in another segment of the game, you know, you might be fighting for your life, you know, in a back alley of Chinatown. It is the closest thing that you'll ever get to being Indiana Jones. Very dangerous. You go first. All of these action moments, all these adventure moments in Indiana Jones, sort of the, the great suspense, uh, the huge action, the problem solving, all of these things, we took those elements and put them in the game. Probably the most terrifying moment is with giant spiders in the Staff of Kings and you've got this torch and you're going through this really dark and mysterious temple and you come across and you're on this bridge and suddenly all these little things start, you know, coming at you. You can take your Wiimote and just swing the torch and just burn these guys before they basically, you know, bite you to death. One of the really cool things about this game is the interactive objects in the environment, which we're calling the hot set. You could use your whip to bring down bookcases on enemies. You can grab an item, use it as a weapon. We actually incorporate three different gestures with the whip. Uh, so depending on what different gesture system that you do, it'll actually uh, latch onto enemies in a different way. No other game currently out there right now does that. This is incredible. We're really excited that Indiana Jones and the Staff of Kings is coming out on the Wii platform, but it is coming out also on PS2, uh, Nintendo DS, which actually has stylus-based gameplay, and also on the Sony PSP, which has some additional bonus content you won't see in any other platforms. Early men could not have conceived, much less built it. To me, the core part of the Indiana Jones experience is that real strong sense of adventure. And you know, this game is no different. You're just going off and getting in all sorts of trouble with all new adventures and all new characters, and you're running and escaping out of temples, and you're flying all over the world, and you're looking for all this stuff, and, and it's just really fun because it's right there on your Wii in your living room. <laughs>